Game of the week tonight will have you feeling extra patriotic. Eagles against Eagles. Class 2A North Cobb Christian having the season of their lives. One loss on the record this season. Meanwhile, Columbia's got experience, picked up a playoff win last year. Kelly Price and Super Blaine showing us who's raising that golden hand. First stop on the journey. So we got to keep going, keep working hard. Man, let's just... Let's, just have, let's have some fun. Don't leave anything tonight, man. Leave it all on the field. Week one. Yes, five steps to it. Today is step number one. Y'all got that. Yes, sir. Leave no doubt. We appreciate that North Cobb Christian brought out the fireworks for the high five sports game of the week. But unfortunately for both these Eagle teams meeting tonight for the first time, not a lot of spark on the scoreboard. In the first, the pass from North Cobb Christian quarterback Maddie Go goes the other way. Sabian Campbell snatches this one in the end zone in midair, taking away NCCS's first scoring opportunity. The Eagles of Columbia have put up more than 2,500 rushing yards this season, and they relied early and often on their workhorse, Royce Tolbert. But the end zone eluded them in the first quarter as well. Midway through the second quarter, Eagles put the thing down, flip it, and reverse it for the score. Georgia Tech commit Jacob Cruz helps his Eagles take a 7-0 lead into the half. Let's fast forward to a wild fourth quarter, and let's see if I get this right. Finley Ross attempting a 25-yard field goal. It is blocked. Kadarius Bailey gets his paws on it. Shout out to BG Gurrier, who gets his paws on it to knock it out, as fellow lineman Gabe Fortson, another Georgia Tech commit, recovers it for the score. Did you guys get all that? NCCS goes up 14-0. Six minutes to play for a right in the second round. Columbia's Jaden Bow with a 17-yard catch and run for the big first down that sets up Elijah Morgan finding Bow again who extends all the way and breaks the plane for the seven yard score but they miss the extra point so it's 14 to 6. They fought to the final whistle but it's Maddie Go and his Eagles that come away with the W tonight 14 to 6 the final score. Given how kind of wild that game was especially down to the finish I mean how good is it that you guys were able to close that out going forward knowing you can do that. Toughness toughness of our senior class uh, each and every one of them just I mean we were limping on and off the field but they just man they just tough as nails well, what's it like to go on to the next round with this team I mean we, we about to go all the way yeah. I mean, this, this is what we're waiting for it's not just a second round. We're going all the, way. all the way. You heard it here first, and you guys got this golden hand trophy to celebrate with as you go on to the next round of the playoffs. Okay, they're going all the way, so who will they face next? We'll